Hey guys, what's going on? TB Stewie here, and welcome to another episode of Discover Minecraft here on the Discover Minecraft server. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Uh, the first episode was awesome. Now, the second episode, I'm going to do a little bit of a project, and you can see by my chunk boundaries that it involves chunks and the biome that I was in, that I have my home set at. I still haven't died, which is awesome, but I did lose an episode actually lost about four hours worth of work that I was recording to time lapse and it wasn't fun but I'm gonna go back to my spot I've got to level down a little bit more on my thing I've got a time lapse that I've already recorded for that and we're gonna start building a slime grinder now for those of you that don't know slime grinders are OP they only spawn in certain chunks at certain heights so yeah it's a little bit of a challenge. I'm trying to figure out the best way for me to make one super efficient that will work. But I've got all of the groundwork done. I've dug out a giant hole. Let's run and run back to the home and check it out. I've still got to fill in a couple small holes, but you know, whatever. So this is my swamp biome. I forgot to move my chests and stuff, so yeah, that's all leveled. We came down quite a ways. Oh, mobs. I don't have my sword on me. Now, there's this abandoned mine shaft I found over here in this corner. Which goes into a ravine. Let's not go there. But this ravine, I don't know if it's the same one or another one, but there's a ravine over this way as well. And it's completely separate from the one that we were exploring last episode, which is nice. Yeah, this is going to be the framework for my slime grinder. Now, you have to be a certain distance away for them to spawn you can't be more than 32 or they can despawn now we don't want them to despawn so what we're going to do is we're going to take this oh I got a zombie head we're going to take this and I'm going to mine all these ores out here in a little bit but we're going to take this and we're going to toss that we're going to make this one two three four five so that's ten chunks of slime spawn ability and they're going to fall into a pool and be pushed down this way to a room with a roof where they drown and drop their slime balls into hoppers I've still got to get more iron for all the hoppers I should have enough after I clean out all of this but not sure yet kinda wanna do hoppers um probably just push them down to two separate hoppers going into two double chests um, and have several spawning platforms for the slimes all these mobs and see how it turns out um, hopefully it's not too bad This epic skelly battle, and we're just a spectator for it. Come on. Fine. I'll finish you. I will finish you. Yeah, we'll pick back up when it's daytime, I think. Yeah, it sounds like a good idea to me. Actually, you know what? Nah. We'll roll with it. So, I've got this massive thing leveled out. And it's going to be... The building itself is going to be within the ten chunks. Um, well, the walls won't be. The spawning platforms go four out from the wall. On the sp and the chunks. So, I don't know whether to build the platforms 
the maximum of the chunks since they are swamp biome slimes will spawn between 51 and 69 i want to maximize that as for spawning and see what happens um definitely going to need a lot of resources i found that slabs work the best um so you can do three and a half blocks they spawn they're happy they they die unhappily but you can get a 33 percent more platform so you get 33 percent more spawning and all that good stuff and i need food Whew, i have button I got chicken somewhere. One of those chests up there. But yeah, let's, I guess, dive right in. <laughs>
All right, guys, so we made some progress. Uh, we didn't finish the wall. I ran out of cobblestone. I'm going to do some off-camera mining, get the, get the rest of this cobblestone to finish this thing up, and start filling in these layers for the slimes to spawn, and work on a method to kill them. I know the best way is either drowning or cactus. I'm probably going to set up a... If capable sort of thing down here that pushes them towards one end or the other of the pool and they'll go into a drowner and drown and all their slime balls will belong to me but I'll figure that out for sure in the next episode and yeah make sure you leave a like comment favorite share um, subscribe subscribe <laughs>